there ever been any moments of public decency? <laughs> Let's start there. <laughs> hmm? One time. Okay, okay. Okay. Welcome to the YouTube edition of Questions Nobody Really Asks. Okay. Okay. Do you want to introduce yourself? Okay. I'm Naledi. I'm uh, a YouTuber as well. And um, I'm currently doing this first video with you guys. I don't even know what I'm going to be asked. So I better not be asked anything creepy because I'm not going to tell you where I hit the body. I'm going to ask you a couple of questions. Mm -hmm. Some might be funny, some might be awkward, some you might want to share because you hit the body some way. It's going to be fun. Okay? okay, so this is the YouTuber edition of the questions nobody really asks. Starting with my lady from Beauty Corner and say. Yes. Ready? Okay. Okay. First question. What do you wear to bed? <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't like sleeping in pants, so normally it's a t-shirt and underwear but as of late I've been told that it's really really cool to sleep naked and it helps you in one way or the other so but I don't sleep naked but I was thinking about it but no I sleep with my t-shirt and my underwear have you ever dug for gold and put it in your mouth of course I have what kind of question is <laughs> <laughs> okay wait guys everybody always wanted to know what snot tastes like I'm not the only one. I'm not saying I do it now anymore, but yes, yes, I. Had to. <laughs> uh, next question. What's your most memorable moment? Okay, at first it was when I matriculated, but now I think my most memorable moment is my graduation day. Mm -hmm. It mm -hmm. is my most memorable moment. Your high school crush. Don't tell me about Linton or Lily. <laughs> Let me tell you guys a story. Wherever he is now, I don't want to say his name. Am I supposed to say his name? No, you don't have to. Okay, well, my high school crush was this really awkwardly smart guy who turned out to be a douchebag because he used that as a front to be a douchebag. So he is actually stupid. Yeah, very stupid. Cool, cool. Are you familiar with who Kermit the Frog is? Yeah. Good. Spill some tea. Ah! <laughs> um, what kind of tea? Good tea. Oh. Tea that you feel that people are going to love to know about here on YouTube. You know, we're trying to get people to know you a little bit more. Tea about myself. Tea about, tea about yourself, tea about your friend, spill some tea. We'll get back to it. We'll get back to the tea. Okay. Yes, we'll get back to that. Okay. So you're eating something delicious and it falls to the floor. Pick First second up. rule. <laughs> <laughs> if it's delicious, guys, I'm not even going to second guess it. I'm like... Have you ever laughed so hard that you felt yourself slightly peeing your pants? I've done more than peeing my pants. I don't even want to get into that topic. But yes, I've laughed so hard. I've farted. I've laughed so hard. I've peed in my pants. I'm actually surprised anybody who actually falls for me. It's 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 really it's it's a big thing because yeah, I've peed in my pants before. <laughs> if you've ever stolen anything, what have you stolen? Biggest thing you've actually stolen? The biggest thing I've actually stolen mm -hmm. was my own car when I didn't have a license and then my dad found out and almost murdered me but I'm here to tell the tale mm, that's yeah. wonderful <laughs> I stole my own car guys technically it's not stealing if it's yours but because I didn't have a license now let you a pap I still believe that this is a real thing but how old were you when you found out that Santa wasn't real was Santa ever real? Santa is real. Guys, no, there was no such thing in my family, hey? That thing was a myth. My dad took us with, he's like, I'm buying you your presents. He wrapped them in front of us and we had to be surprised on Christmas. Like, I knew what I was getting. Everybody always knew what they were getting on Christmas. Mm -hmm. So, what, what, if I think about it, no. The only thing my parents did fool me with is the tooth fairy. I legit believed in the tooth fairy. 
Because I'd always get a five rand under my bed and it turns out it's your damn parents. <laughs> I was so, I was crushed when I found out that while you're sleeping, your parents creep underneath the pillow and take your tooth. What do they do with the tooth? <laughs> they throw it into the toilet. Flush it away. I'm telling you right now. Okay. Being Mary Jane or insecure? Sure. That's a hard one. No, 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 no. You can't pick. You cannot pick. Why? You cannot pick. Because I love being Mary Jane, but I also love insecure. Yo. No, I'm not picking. I'm setting this one out. How many times a day do you brush your teeth and be honest? Once. <laughs> This, I'm brushing it twice, they're gonna get wider. We all know that's a myth, okay? <laughs> if your teeth are generally dirty, then as skis, or if you have smelly breath, by all means, brush, brush them twice. But now, when I get up, I brush them and I keep it moving. The only time I used to brush my teeth a lot is when I had braces. Oh, I used to brush my teeth a lot. Any moments of public indecency? If so, yes, tell us the story but make it very, very, very politically correct. Have there ever been any moments of public decency? <laughs> Let's start there. Must it be? Moments of public indecency. Are we thinking of the same thing when we're saying this? It could be public indecency means a bunch of things. Okay, give me an example so that I don't embarrass myself. But so there's... <laughs> yes, yes. And then there's peeing in the street. Drinking Is that in even street. indecency anymore? That's just living. See a pillar. We are living. Where must we pee if there are no toilets? Yeah? No. All the time. Okay. I'll tell you what's a Republican decency. Mm -hmm. Um, I was young, I was in high school, and I actually went to, to my friend's place, and basically what happened is, her, we snuck alcohol, obviously she was having a sleepover, and we obviously snuck the alcohol, so she called up a couple of her guy friends, and we were all walking to the quarter place at like 8, 9 in the evening. So then, I had to pee. <laughs> The one guy walks and waits for me, like he waits like a distance away while I'm peeing. And as I pee, I don't squat low enough. So I ended up peeing on the jeans. Yo! Guys! <laughs> and, then, and then the guy was trying to fondle my bum. He's like, why are your jeans wet? I'm like, no! I tripped and fell in some water. Little guys, you know, you touched my pee, so... Sorry. <laughs> if you're watching this, I'm really, really sorry. <laughs> And you know what I'm talking about. I'm really sorry. What don't they tell you about being a YouTuber? Good or bad? First of all, they don't tell you about the work that's involved in being a YouTuber. Second of all, they don't tell you about the public scrutiny that comes with being a YouTuber. But the good thing, the good things they obviously don't tell you is how rewarding it is to be a YouTuber. Some people think people who are famous are because they're cool. No. Even the small YouTubers, you know, having having those 10 people that follow you because they believe in what you're saying or they actually enjoy your personality is one of the most rewarding things about YouTube. I can never see myself quitting. Okay. For the money. <laughs> for the money. For the free thing. Okay. No, I'm kidding, guys. I'm not really. Uh -uh. Seeing as you were the obvious choice for this first edition of Awkward Questions No One Ever Asks a YouTuber, who would you like to do this series? Mm -hmm. Who would I like? The next person. Lucy from Schlanga. Okay. Must I pick other people? Yeah, you're more than welcome. Lucy from Schlanga, Lucy from Falda, Pop Culture. Your Pop Culture is doing anything. Yes, I can actually mention quite a few people. Pop Culture is in Cape Town. Everybody I follow, Tandy, Mikhail, Sanesh. Everyone I follow under the sun. Curve Cut. I'd like to see if Curve Cut do it. No, but then I'm gonna mention all the YouTubers I follow. I mean, really now. Y'all. Um, who did I who did, did I follow recently? I think her name is Danny. Um, Y'all just need to, no, pick. I'll pick, can I pick the top five? Yes. Mshlanga, Mpanza, Ndamase. Uh, what's the initial name? Naidu. Is it Naidu? Naidu. Sineshni, uh, yeah. Sineshni Nadu. And um, I'm still trying. Gamma. Gamma definitely. Get out of back. Yeah. 
I've picked the, the top five. The next person will pick the other five. Yes, that's right. Okay, thank you very much, Nadeli from you. Beauty Corner SA for joining us. Thank you. It's been wonderful. See you at Cheers. Bye. Oh, but wait. You said I'm going to get something free. Nothing. Just, just a week. She fooled me and said I'm going to get a drink if I do this. I did. I did. I'm out.